Hello everybody, in this little short and fun video I'm going to be talking about why I am going to get the Xbox Series X at launch instead of the PS5. Even though I have a PS4 and a PS3, those are the consoles I've had forever, I've never had an Xbox before. But I'm going to be talking about the reasons why I am switching starting next week. Number one is definitely a big one is just the whole new experience of playing a next generation console and it really being one I've never played before or had any you know um, achievement points I guess that's the, what the word is gamer score on it it'd be really fun and new to completely explore and also document that journey on YouTube on my channel um, it's kind of funny seeing how right now I'm playing Spider-Man PS4 on the channel as a walkthrough and I've been going through platinum I've been uh, trophy hunting but for achievements, um, we're going to be doing walkthroughs for that and other stuff. And I think it's going to be really fun. And in my real life, um, I actually have two friends already who are on Xbox, like personal friends. And the other ones I have who are on PlayStation, I'm actually not friends with them because it's a long story. Because I didn't really have any ability to when we were in high school together. Um, just because I didn't really have a PS4 until I was a junior, my summer after junior year of high school. But whatever, we can talk about that later. Um, and also, just the community online, I'm definitely more of an Xbox guy when it comes to other stuff, other opinions than PlayStation. I definitely appreciate Xbox community a lot more, even though I'm not part of it. I just think uh, it's a better fit for me if we're going to talk about the community. Um, yeah, that's the first reason. It's basically community. Number two is everything you can do with the Xbox, and it has funny as it is, which I'm not going to show a picture of my computer in this video, but my computer is actually a Windows Lenovo 5 laptop. I got it a little over three years ago, and it would fit with my Xbox already. You know, if I had an Xbox, I have the Xbox symbol, or not an Xbox symbol, sorry, the um, Xbox Square to link it up on my computer and obviously I don't have an Xbox so I don't use it and it'll be really fun. I also like how the Xbox is a... Uh, I know the PlayStation 5 will be able to do it too but I think the Xbox will be a lot better when it comes to uh, you know being more than just a video game system. Being like a streaming system. I'm getting the, obviously I'm getting the Series X for the disc player. I'm definitely more of a physical media guy at the moment and it just seems like a more of a well-rounded console when it comes to everything um, when it comes you know for electronics for media and I really appreciate that and I'm excited to learn more about that and play with it number three I guess there's more than one but this could also be going with number two is just the uh, raw power this is the most powerful piece of hardware at least for video gaming of all time you see the specs on there, and it's even more powerful. Oh, well, I mean, more powerful than anything Sony will give out. And so why not if it's the exact same price? And I know some people say, oh, you know, you know, there's no games, or the games aren't good enough. Well, I do see your point, and that is why I'm saying, well, I'll go PS5. Maybe when uh, Spider-Man PS5 comes out, and by that I mean the, you know, Peter Parker Spider-Man PS5 comes out. Or just, you know, the sequel. Well, real sequel. Anyway. Um, but yeah, that's only in the Series X at launch. I'm so excited to test it out and check it out. It'll be so much fun, I think. I mean, I know it will be because, come on. Well, actually, that will lead into number three. The games. Now, I know one of these is already out, Watch Dogs Legion. But I'm planning to get that, or, you know, play that first. Show all you guys when I get the Xbox. And... Then there's Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker Saga, there is the whole rumor, or not even a rumor, it actually is true that W or sorry, Microsoft almost bought WB games. Who knows how if we would have gotten a whole bunch of ex or if you, Xbox would have gotten a whole bunch of exclusives for Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker Saga versus if it was on PlayStation. I'm so excited to play that game. All the marketing material has been from just uh, gameplay on the Xbox and marketing saying it's only on the Xbox consoles. That's a little bit weird, but can't wait to play that. And of course, Gotham Knights. I think that will come out in summer. Um, just because Skywalker Saga is their next WB game. And I think it comes out March 3rd at the moment. Um, so I'm super excited to play all these next-gen games. I know, once again, I said Legion's already out. But we'll see. And yeah, those are my reasons or just my thoughts, ultimately, on why I'm getting the Xbox Series X at launch instead of the PS5. Um, and yeah. 
I don't know if this will affect my other channel, The Real Super Sam, my so to say main one, but it'll be so exciting to see the future of this channel and videos, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good day.